is the energy vibration reading for you Pisces. This is a good month for you Pisces. Let's see what's coming up. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Horizon, Sun. It's going to be a really good month. The week begins, the month begins with four weeks. I want to say thank you for being here, Pisces. And thank you for uh, liking and sharing. Please share these videos. Remember, these are general reading. Pisces, let's see what's coming up for the Pisces. The Pisces, Sun, Moon, Horizon, Sun. I see the energy of the lovers in the first week. Whatever the issue and the situation is, I see you're going to be dealing with some situation with family or situation that has to do with uh, your partner, okay? Whether you're married or you're in a relationship, that is what's coming up. I see a new start in the second week that is coming up. This is a week of Valentine's. Happy birthday to um, the... Um, to the Pisces who are having birthdays, I see a new start is coming up. So you have water and hair coming in the month of February. Then I see some judgment call. A new start judgment call is coming up. Whatever this issue situation that is plain, I see the energy of judgment calls are coming up. And I see that this judgment call has to do with an institute or an organization. So um, it could be situation with work or it could be a judgment call with government institutes and organizations. So whatever that is and whatever that is transpiring, I see some judgment call comes uh, up. It is um, the energy of a wheel of fortune. Whatever is the, the energy vibration and the alignment of energy. Ooh, okay. I see lies and deceptiveness with an institute the organization is going to be coming up for you guys. You're going to be finding out about some lies and deceptiveness. It is all coming out with an institute the organization. I see the energy of you protecting yourself. You're having a new start and you are really protecting yourself. So um, whatever that has been transpiring, I see a new start. Some of you are dealing with uh, um, the energy of... Uh, um and uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius some of you are dealing with the energy of an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and the lies and deceptiveness of this person okay in an institute a corporation however that is coming up so um it could be your father is in the hospital and they're not speaking the truth that sort of a thing but I see lies and deceptiveness coming out in an institute a organization and it has to do with um, a man that is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. I see you're cutting truth BS. So whatever is transpiring in the second week, you guys are cutting through the BS and using the sword of truth to cut through the BS with a deceptive man. That is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius. It's a deceptive Sagittarius man. Okay, so that is good. Then I see the four of pentacles. I see you're going to be finding financial balance that is going to be coming up. This is going to be good. However, this is transpiring financial balance is going to be coming up for you Pisces. And this is good. Then I see the energy of the Ace of Cups. Um, for some of you ladies, you could be getting pregnant. However, this is coming up. I see new love is coming in. And it could be um, with the energy that you're in a relationship. And I see you're going to be um, clearing up whatever issues and situation in this relationship. And you are going to be starting over and you and this is going to be good. Now, whatever is transpiring, some of you are really dealing with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person in a corporation, institution, or in your life. Some of you, it could be your father, that there um, is a situation with doctors and that sort of a thing, and you're trying to figure out and cut and chew the BS. This is going to be happening in the first week if your father, I see you're trying to find the truth with a situation, and I see you're going to be standing up for someone who you really love in your life also. So this is good. So the energy of the lovers is a pentacle and you start with money for you and your partner or you and your family. So if you were going through hardship with you and your family, a new start is coming in. I see new work is coming in. I see some of you are going to be offered a new job. Uh, so this is good. Some of you are definitely going to be offered a new job. This is good. I see information is going to come in that is going to be helping you. Um, however, this is coming in. This information is going to be coming in in the third week and you're going to be receiving some help. In the last week, I see you're receiving an offer from an institute or organization. So I see um, government institutes or organizations. Some of you could be going to work for government um, institutes and organization. 
okay so that is good so I see um, money is definitely going to be coming in for you and your partner I see work is going a new start with work is going to be coming up for some of you and I see information that help is going to be coming in for you you ladies I see you're dealing with an issue and a situation with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius whoever this person is it's coming up as your partner so you ladies be aware of this okay then I see some of you are protecting yourself and standing grounds and protecting yourself. Whatever is to inspire, I see some of you standing grounds and protecting yourself from the Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person. I see lies and deceptiveness in a corporation institute. Say lies and deceptiveness in a corporation institute, and it has to do with a Gemini or an Aquarian. So lies um, and uh, deceptiveness in an institute, an organization, it has to do with an Aquarian or a Gemini. Okay. I see money is definitely going to be coming in for you Pisces whatever is happening and transpiring money is definitely coming in for you Pisces men or women money is coming in okay unexpected money I see a healing with your financial stability is going to be coming up this is going to be wonderful whatever that was happening and transpiring I see a healing is going to be coming up between you and a Taurus however that play out in your life I see healing coming up there is going to be a new start with your financial stability i see money also coming in for you guys so heartbreaks with a new love is coming up so some of you pisces heartbreaks is going to be happening with a new love in your life so some of you could have started a relationship and i see heartbreaks is coming up for you guys with a new love so however that is transpiring whether you're a man or a woman this is what I see I see it's more of money um, money that is coming up there is a lot of money money that is coming up I see some of you could have started a relationship and um, you're gonna be heartbroken so however that it happens and that transpire I see this so you could be in a relationship and uh, um, you start a new relationship and I see this person heartbreaks with you and this person so I see the energy of you and your partner. If your partner is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius, I see there is divorce that is coming up or there is some deceptiveness in a government institute or organization. They have to pay you a lot, okay? So there was some deceptiveness in the government institutes and organization. They're going to pay you a lot. I see long-term stability is going to be coming up for you guys. I see a new start with your business. Um, a new start at a work long-term stability is going to come up and I see you are definitely going to be protecting yourself from whatever deceptiveness unexpected love but an organization institutes it is going to be coming up and some of you are going to be receiving an offer from this corporation institute say so it's good 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 if you're starting a new job if you're starting um a new job if you're starting a new contract i see this is going to be good it's going to be working out for you in the long run success over some deceptiveness with um an aries Leo or a sagittarius person success you're going to be very successful with uh, over a deceptiveness with an aries Leo or a sagittarius man in a corporation institute see i see some of you um men are dealing with some deceptiveness um, in a government institutes your organization you're going to be successful coming out of this some of you are dealing with a deceptive Gemini and a deceptive Aquarian some of you are dealing with a, a deceptive Gemini or a deceptive Aquarian I see heartbreaks for you ladies you ladies I see heartbreaks if you started a new relationship um, with um, a Taurus I see heartbreaks is coming up for you ladies okay um, I see some of you ladies are going to be healing a situation with a, um, a Capricorn, a Capricorn man. Some of you ladies could be healing a situation with a Capricorn man. However, that is coming up. I see you healing a situation with a Capricorn man. Um, I see some of you are in um, a relationship. Um, this could be a new relationship. I see heartbreak. Some of you ladies could be losing a child heartbreaks um hardship um and some of you uh, who um started a new relationship i see heartbreaks coming up conflicts 
and heartbreaks coming up with a relationship that some of you are starting. You men are going to be very successful, successful dealing with a Gemini or a Aries, a Gemini. Some of you are going to be successful over a Gemini because an institute the organization is going to find out that this Gemini has been lying. Okay, and you're going to be very successful. Ladies, I see you overcoming an issue with a, an Aries man in an organization or institute. Whoever this Aries man, for some of you Aries, uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius, I see that whatever that has transpired, you're going to be coming out successfully. So if some of you were dealing with government institutes or organization, I see long-term stability is going to be happening for you and I see a balance is going to be coming in an unexpected luck. So institutes or organization, government institutes or organization, people who are dealing with these sort of a huge corporation, I see that some of you could be receiving a job to at the end of uh, um, the month to go and work with one of these institutes uh, organization. I see lies and deception that was there. But I see you men and women coming out. Women, you're standing very strong in this month, especially um, women 40 years and older. I see you strong, especially if you work in a huge um, corporation. I see you taking down a man in a huge corporation, you women, okay? So however that is playing out. But with new love, this is not a month for love, Pisces, because what is transpiring, some of you women... I found a new love um, and you're going to be heartbroken. Whoever this new love is that you women are going to be fine, you're going to be heartbroken. I see a lot of you are healing a situation with a Capricorn. Whatever that was that has transpired between you and a Capricorn, I see you healing the situation and trying to resolve whatever that has been going on. So um, this is good. Let's look. We're using the animal totem cards. So let's see what animals is going to be coming up. I see the end of a cycle for you, Pisces, in um this month. If you were going through some hardship or you were going through a cycle, I see the end of a cycle in this month. And this is going to be good. So whatever the issue is and the situation is, I see the end of a cycle that is going on in this month. Okay. So let's see what two um, animal energies is coming up. Okay, so we have two animal energy, card one and card two. If you take this card, is the energy of the dragon. And uh, I see you uh, ladies in huge corporation or dealing with a dragon in a huge corporation. And I see you ladies are really standing up and working. So whoever you are that choose the energy of the dragon, I see you are standing up and working, but you need to work with the dragon, not in the reverse, but you need to work with the dragon in, uh, in upright, okay? So then we have the buffalo, and the buffalo is an earth energy, so I see balance because there's a lot of money that is coming in. I see um, financial balance is the energy for you guys in this year in this month where you're going to be having a lot of financial balance and new jobs offer are going to be coming in and this is going to be good but don't use these energies especially this earth energy in the reverse you need to use it in the upright because if you use the buffalo in the reverse you're not balancing out because i see some deceptiveness that you have to deal with so i, I see you're changing the existence and the energy of the buffalo instead of standing up you're going reverse but when you work with a reverse energy you can't balance out something good okay the other energies that I'm using is past life. So however that is coming up, um, this is the energy of a past life that is coming in. Okay. So we are having these past life energies. Let's see what is happening. Okay. So I see that some of you need to break your, uh, this is card one, this is card two. Now, card one is vows, and I see that some of you need to break the vows, okay? So, um, in past life, you have taken vows, and you need to break this vow, okay? Whatever vows you have taken in past life, you need to break the vows. It is good to do a reading to see your past life, so I can help you to break your vows. So, some of you are in karmatic relationship. You men 
are in karmatic relationship these relationship are karmatic that you're dealing with karma from past lifetime however this is coming up that's why um, some of you ladies with a new love you were heartbroken because you were dealing with a karmatic relationship so however this is playing for you and however this is trends uh, foreign in your life there is karmatic relationship that has been playing out okay so this is good and wonderful so Pisces it looks like a very good month I'm saying namaste until next time Thank you.